Hi everyone, Rosa here. Um, it's been a while since my last video, especially since the last one I uploaded. Um, uh, I can't even remember when that was, to be honest. Um, I did film a couple of videos in the meantime, but I uh, didn't upload them for various reasons. Uh, many of those reasons were deadlines but also a couple of things that I was working on and um, that were making making videos <laughs> um, a little bit more complicated than I'd like them to be. So first things first, um, I now have a Patreon and um, you can find the link in the description box below. Um, I'm easily distracted media on Patreon. Uh, yeah, the channel name here is easily distracted planner. But as I've been talking about, I'm an author and I write a lot of different things and uh, easily distracted media seemed like a good idea to combine all of those things together. Um, which is also why I'm now more comfortable sharing what I'm about to share, which is the fact that, yeah, I talked about uh, my main pen name, Rosa Swan, quite a few times. Um, this is the main pen name that I make my money on, um, which is also the main of the stuff that you always see on my videos and within the planning. Um, to that, um, last year, I talked a couple of times about a side project I was working on and I kind of used some coded, coded ways to actually talk about it but um, that project is actually my young adult pen name Emmy Engbert. I've been writing for that pen name since last July and the first whole story is actually the whole novel basically is actually about to finish with the final, uh, uh, well, final chapter, the, the, the epilogue uh, tomorrow, which is the 2nd of May. I don't know when I'm uploading this. So 2nd of May, the epilogue will be uploaded on Tapas. Um, and I actually have a third pen name, which is sort of, I was getting a little complicated because I was spending a lot of time on it. And then I didn't want to out myself as another pen name. And, um, well, that made things a little bit more complicated than I'd like to and that kind of stopped me from doing many videos, that and deadlines. Um, my third pen name that I write under is Skylar Hart. Um, the most recent release for Skylar Hart came out on the 18th of April. It's called Blaze, when you're in most of the world and when you're in the UK. Um, for most of Europe, the name of the book is actually Unraveled. Uh, slightly different covers. Uh, basically, marketing kind of stuff. Anyway, um, big deadlines, lots of writing to do for that pen name. And um, I kind of didn't want to out myself, which I am doing now, um, which you'll also see on my Patreon. I'll Somewhere I'll show the name so you can easily um, get to it. Um, it's adult uh, tagged on Patreon, so you can't find me through the regular search functions on Patreon. Uh, kind of complicated. So link in the description because I'm actually doing a plan with me May monthly overview. Um, I've done weekly overviews in the past and I'll probably do some of them again soon, but my monthly overview um, I'm doing this since it's setting up different things and uh, yeah, that's kind of where I'm at. If you have any questions, just ask either on social media or uh, in the comments here and I guess we're going to dive in. Um, I'm using a passion planner, the compact and yeah, it's the Echo Compact Planner. Um, I've been using it for the whole year already. I really like it, most of it. 
Um, and I use, I make one of these every month. Or, well, print them off. Um, top three goals, my work count focus for the month, what I'm publishing, some notes, and on the back I keep track of my, like, put it the other way, of my social media stats, um, which I can now, you know, openly show. Um, let's, yeah, and here is my mostly empty passion planner monthly. First, let's write on this. For May, my top three goals are for Rosa to finish Omega's. Alpha um, for Emmy. I'm writing the other dress, which is my second uh, story under this pen name. Uh, like I said, the first one's just finished. Officially finished, I wrote it, but it's going to be uploaded tomorrow. Um, and um, the first story was Her Elysium, which is a young adult uh, lesbian romance about two gamer girls falling in love. And the other dress is um, the story of two um, cosplayers who love cosplaying uh, magical girls, things like Can't Captain Sakura or um, uh, Tokyo Mew Mew, although that's quite an old one, but it, it, it's magical girl kind of stuff. And um, the main character is a transgender girl, and um, her love interest is a boy who loves cross-dressing. So you, you, you get a bit of all sorts of stuff, nerdy, and um, I, I love anime, but uh, I haven't really had time to watch a lot lately. But yeah, really looking forward to writing that. And um, I'm starting a new project, yes, new project, which is a um, lit RPG, uh, liter yeah, literary role-playing game story. Um, lots of these stories are people getting stuck in video games or um, through virtual reality ending up in a video game. Uh, it, it's very fun and I really like the idea of it and um, I've got a story going, well started with it. Um, yeah, so I can't really share much because I don't have that much yet. Let me just grab I'm going to do the other side of this and grab my I thought my table was big enough, but I don't know. Um, so start of the month, which is the final month, the previous one. Uh, next week is 19, so These are the Mondays. I fill these out on Monday. So the start is basically the final Monday of the previous week, which was the 18, uh, week 18, which was uh, the 30th of April yesterday. Uh, okay. um, there's this one newsletter. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of doing them going always because I just reorganized them when I made this uh, new one for this so getting used to the new layout uh, here we are and that's all the numbers from last month and now I'm going to 
put my page into the planner. Now we can actually start filling the planner. First things first, the, well, the generally not as much fun things to do, which are my administration tasks. So next Monday I'm doing my finances. The week after I'm doing Amazon ads. And the one after that, yeah, I need to pay the rent on my office. Lovely office, but you know, rent is one of those things that kind of have to be paid. <laughs> yeah, I don't work from home because I have a boyfriend and two cats who are well, boyfriends at home often, but the cats are always at home and they prefer me paying attention to them over me working. So, um, I have the work count focus part, my publish part, and my noted to do's. This one generally tends to stay empty though. Um, I have it because I can use it, just like I've got the things on the other side there, but I don't generally tend to use them. So, hmm. It's empty space, it looks good this way. Um, let's start with publish. Uh, this week, uh, tomorrow, uh, Omega Destined Alpha 6, which I'm editing today and then publishing tomorrow. Next up is, uh, let's just first write them in here, Omega Destined Alpha. Six next week is Omega Destined Alpha Volume One, which is um, a sort of a box set of the first four parts of the serial, and then the twenty third we have Omega Destined Alpha Seven. And on Saturdays I release. Uh, the other dress for Emmy, chapter 4, chapter 5, 6, 7, okay, this way I know when I need to have stuff finished. Um, so then on the 5th we have the other dress for next up nine. Priorities. First up is the other dress for project name. Even though I'm only publishing, or oh, yeah, publishing until. The seventh chapter this month um, for my Patreon, people can read ahead a couple of chapters. Um, there, there are not that many chapters uploaded yet because I've just set it up and I wasn't ahead yet. But I'm working on getting ahead of these uh, so that by the end of the month, people on my Patreon will have been able to read up to chapter 10 or 11, while people who follow me on uh, Tapas well, have read up to chapter seven. That way, you know, people can get a little bit extra if they support me. So it's always fun. Then next workout focus is 
eight, because the eighth will be out the month, the week, first week of June. So I should probably have finished it by then. I've got a couple of days for Rosa Swan. I generally use uh, a writing week, a publishing week, a writing week, a publishing week. So even though this is a writing week and I've got a couple of days into the next month, I'm hoping to finish it early. So I get a bit of time to do other things. And then I want to start on my lit RPG. I have no real date for those. So these are all 2000 word chapters. And these are 18,000 word episodes, which get me up to 50k for the month in total. 50,000 words. I'm, I'm hoping to do about 40,000 words on this publishing date. Priority is a little bit, like I said, um, because of writing and publishing weeks, the priorities aren't as straightforward as it sometimes looks when it comes to writing, because I'll have to finish certain things before other things. Okay, rephrase, I'll sometimes have to finish parts for the Rosa Swan episodes before I can finish that week's part for uh, uh, one of the chapters for an Emmy book. Uh, for example, Omega's Destined Alpha 7. I'll generally try to have finished before uh, Saturday. So that priority is higher than um, priority of the Omega's Destined Alpha is higher than the other dress. That one gets really low priority. Um, oh, I'm missing one. Her Elysium epilogue is going live on Wednesday, but that's already been uh, scheduled, so I don't really have to do anything for it. And Honestly, that's how I plan a monthly view, both in uh, setting up my social media tracking so I can see how things grow, um, my goals for the month, my work I focus and my publishing so that I know what's, you know, what's happening when and then I get a real overview on this side. I don't tend to use my monthly much apart from doing this because um, this works better in my brain to visualize what's going on when. Um, thank you so much for watching. Please leave comments, subscribe to the channel, um, like the video if you enjoyed it yeah. and if you don't didn't enjoy it you know maybe leave a comment why I don't know something like that. Um, you can totally check out my Patreon, uh, patreon.com slash uh, easily distracted media. I'll also have that link in the description and see you next time. Bye.